like that it doesn't take you out too far either. Like you're not going like way out wide. Yeah. But you're still getting a really good stretch. How long ago is it you competed now? Like three weeks? Four weeks? No, it's been almost, it's been five weeks. Now. Five weeks? Yeah, Saturday now. So yeah, okay. But, um, I don't Do you know feel like you're like, watery or just like really full? Watery and full. Okay. Like it's 30 pounds, so some of it's going to be water, obviously. Some muscle, some fat. I think we're, yeah. If, if you feel like that's too far back, one thing I like about this machine is you can like set these yeah. wherever you want to start. So okay. like if you want to start with more stretch on your shoulder. I'll see how it feels. Or you can like, if you want to get too heavy, you can kind of like unload the shoulder. Use this on the regular? I've done three and a half on this one. Yeah? I think that's when I started Halo. <laughs> I did like six months. But yeah, I know, this one gets heavy though, just quickly. I've had times, yeah, like honestly, yeah. like deep in a prep like that, we were like trending Halo. And then like. You get spurts of strength. Yeah, you have like a refeed yeah. or something and you're stronger than off season. Yeah. It's crazy. It's scary though, because you don't want to hurt yourself, because you're like, oh, I, I know I can do it, but. Yeah. You're, you're so lean, you're like, I don't want to fuck anything up. Exactly. Well, you do it anyway. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's so true. Cause I feel like most younger kids are always trying to do more sets. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I feel like once you've been doing this like 10 years, that's where you start to see people like doing like once one work set, two work set and exercise max. Yeah. And like, and then people looking at you like, that's all you do. And you're like, yeah, but there's gradually working up to it, et cetera. And like you said, knowing your weight. Yeah. Like that. higher, higher intensity, yeah. less volume. Or like getting the intensity. most out of that one set instead of trying to like do like, a bunch of half ass sets. Exactly. If you know you're going to do more sets, you're going to save something in the tank for those sets. Yeah. If you know you only have one set, you're going to give it 100%. You'll probably do at least three play times. Yeah. For sure.
Good. Yep. Up. Up. Good. Push. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. One more. Come on. Push. Up. Yep. 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 Okay. Yep. Let's go, man. Time to work. We could do this, maybe. 25. Okay. In the middle, with that at the top. So it's still two and a half plates. Yeah. At the bottom, but it's a plate and a half at the top. It's just easier on the left. Yeah. Side. Literally one. It's yeah. like a, it's like a dual one too, like a, like a flat incline shoulder press one. Oh yeah, yeah. So it's I know just what like you're a, talking about. Yeah. They usually have them in like hotels. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Like honestly, it's actually like, sick though. The equipment in there is yeah. decent, but yeah, like not, there's nowhere near the selection you guys have. Yeah. It's crazy. It, it was even better before, because we had like some of the new tech stuff come in too. And then they got but, rid of uh, They got rid of it, I don't know why, but I mean, that stuff was really nice. Plates down there and it feels like super fucking heavy. Yeah. Then you get a new hack squat, maybe like a Panada one or something, and you could put like six on there and it feels just as heavy. Or so like Atlantis or something, makes yeah. it feel strong as fuck. Exactly, so it's kind of fun like, you know, these ones humble you and these ones boost your ego. <laughs> <laughs> one's good for like a video, the other one's good for every day. This one I feel like has the best squeeze. Yeah. And good stretch. Now it's like a little bit more incline or a little bit more flat. You can just kind of target different like parts different of your fibers. chest. Yeah. That was good.
Oh, I told look. you. Well, look. Oh, yeah. I told you. <laughs> Close. <laughs> Two ninety nine. Point something. <laughs> it's flirting with it. We're just a couple of sips of water away. For real. <laughs> Not bad for a five weeks post show. What did you get for five weeks post show? Would you compete at like two fifty or something? Two fifty seven. What's my best? Like, what's my best look? Thirty five pounds. Yeah. That's not too crazy though. I feel like twenty pounds is just like normal. Because it's like a cruise phase, so it's evening out. Yeah. Like I'm kind of like getting like the muscle into it. Yeah. Less water, less of like the everything was just swollen. Now I can feel like the density is coming back a little bit. There you guys have it. We got, I always want to say Big Joe, but it's actually it's Little, little Joe. Joe. But you know what's funny? Like my, my mom used to call me like the little man, like yeah. the little mister. She used to call me the little mister, but now I'm bigger. So she calls me like the big little mister. <laughs> so he's big little Joe. So, yeah, but yeah, hit some chest, hit some posing. Clearly I got some work to do. But we're both going to get on stage again in 2025. Yeah. Um, well, the last couple times we got on stage, you, know, you beat me twice in a row. I beat you once. Yeah. So two, two to one. So next year it's we'll close. see. Yeah. We'll see what happens next time. But <laughs> anyways, uh, hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Definitely next time Joe's down here at Pure, we we'll get some more training in. It's really, really good. And uh, yeah, man, like we go way back, all the way back to. CBBF, OPA. Yeah, at least 10 Wait. years. No, I was, I was yeah. thinking about that before we even did this workout. I'm like, I've known Robin for like 10 years. We never trained together. Yeah. <laughs> no, I know. I was just thinking about yeah. that too. I was like, it's yeah. crazy. I've known him like since like, yeah, since before we did nationals like in 2020, 2014. Yeah. Just 10 years. So I'm like, that's crazy. Yeah. First workout 10 years later. 10 years. And I also <laughs> think about like how many of those guys are still going from then. That yeah. As hardcore as us. Which is but, crazy. But we stayed like just as hardcore all the way through. So it's kind of crazy. Yeah. You know, a decade of uh, train, training not together, but like growing up together kind of in the sport and like seeing each other train and getting yeah. on stage together and all that stuff. And now we're getting yeah. first call outs together, which is pretty cool. The first calls together. Yeah. We got the Canadian Beef Podcast, so make sure you guys watch that as well. And uh, yeah, that's enough chatting. Time to eat, time to get big. See you guys in the next one. Peace.